Today we are going to dissect a three move sequence that Yannick Collins and I came up with. Thanks for the inspiration Yannick. We will start with a variation of this neck spin sequence, then transition to a continuous pivoting neck spin, then end with the exit of a dragon necklace wrap shot combo. Check the prerequisite links if you're having trouble with any of these moves. Let's begin. First we are going to execute a variation of this neck spin variation. The main change in this version is that we will allow the rope to wrap around our neck twice before bending forward. This is called a suicide wrap. The key is to give ourselves even more slack than we usually do in order to have enough rope for the dart to wrap twice without hitting us in the face. Let's practice this. Our next move is a continuous pivoting neck spin. In order to end up facing the way we would during the full sequence, I'm going to turn around to drill this part. When we attempt the full sequence, the direction might feel reversed because the rope lands on our neck during a different moment, but this is the correct direction. This is definitely the most dizzying piece of the sequence, so give yourself breaks while training. Finally, we can implement the exit of a dragon necklace wrap shot combo. At the end of the continuous neck spin, we wait until we're facing forward and then bring our lead hand close to the back of our neck and grab the rope so that our lead arm looks like it's choking us. We raise our lead foot and step back into wheel plane as we let go of our rope so that the dart shoots forward. We pivot another 90 degrees back into wall plane. Once we feel comfortable with each of these separate steps, we can try to combine them. We start with our neck spin variation. As soon as the dart unwraps from our neck, we can do as many pivots as we feel inspired to. Once we're ready to exit, we shoot the dart behind our back, aiming forward. Now let's watch it in real time. Okay, that is my new taste breaker sequence. These sequences are designed to combine common moves in new ways, which will help us break out of our usual flow pattern and inspire new paths. I want to give a huge thank you to my friends on Patreon for making this video possible. If you like these videos, please consider signing up. Thanks for watching.